for our season finale of Veg on the Edge, our sixth episode to end season one. We were inspired to bring it here to the beach. And the dish that we're going to be creating today is a La Union Surf and Turf. I will be cooking up our vegan version of Yempo that's made out of tofu, tofu skin. But the dish that I'm going to create, which is of my own concoction, is our tofish belly. Tofish belly, did you ever think that you'd be able to eat seafood even though you're vegan? So while we're grilling the tofu chon on the griller, I will be putting up together what we're gonna be stuffing into our tofu belly and make it really taste like that Pinoy version of bangus belly. So I'm just dicing up these tomatoes. Now onto the onions, because we want to have a nice bite into our dish. Next we got ginger, just to give it a nice spice to our filling for the tofu. And the great thing about ginger is that it has all these anti-inflammatory properties and it's a good antibacterial. That's why it's used a lot in medicinal things like uh, Ayurvedic medicine and healing. So we're gonna add about a tablespoon of minced ginger. A teaspoon to a tablespoon of liquid smoke. And then any cooking oil that you may want to use. This is regular olive oil. You know, you always want to get healthier stuff. Just mix that in there. Ingredients that I add to this. I add this nori chips with some sesame seed, just so that the filling as well tastes like fish. So now we have our tasty filling for our tofu belly. Of course, the meat itself is the tofu. Plain tofu, you want it firm, just so that it doesn't break apart and fall apart while it's grilling. I got a block of tofu right here. I'm gonna cut it into two. I'm gonna slice it up open again and stuff in our filling. Gently place that baby on. Himalayan salt. You got to wet that side as well. So the reason why I'm using salted water is because the nori doesn't have any salt in it. There's some that you may buy that has salt, which you can definitely do so, but this one doesn't. So I'm adding Himalayan salt to it, which makes it healthier because of the minerals that's added in Himalayan salt. To get more of the smoky flavor into it, you want to score it a bit, also so it cooks. Para sa mutin lasa. There we have it, surf and turf. But a meal that I create here on Veg on the Edge isn't complete if we have more color into the dish and the meal that we're going to be eating for this beautiful day here by the beach. So we're gonna be creating our salad with our surf and turf, which in true Filipino fashion, it's gonna be ensalada, but I'm gonna add more seafood into it because of course, seafood also includes sea vegetables. So we're gonna add some seaweed into our ensalada. To make it toasty, we have our eggplant. I'm gonna put this on the grill. We have a red onion, tomato, we got a cucumber, green mango, and since it's avocado season, we gotta get some good fat in. Our liempo is right. Ready? So this tofu chon is made out of tofu, tofu skin, and the fat, which, oh my gosh, the texture of it tastes just like fat, but it doesn't have any cholesterol whatsoever because it's made out of cassava. So cassava is a root crop, and usually it's what is an ingredient within tapioca, sago, 
and your favorite milk tea pearls. So the beauty of it all, of having veganized dishes like this, is that even though you know, you're cruelty-free and everything, and you're vegan for your spirituality or vegan for your health, you can still get to enjoy these plant-based veganized versions of your favorite cravings. And I always tell people, it's such a great transition food, you know, then you get to have these dishes, your favorite comfort foods, just like you used to ever since you were a kid and even as you grow up, but now you're conscious of it and it's cruelty. Look how amazing this toefish belly is. I could tell you guys right now, it smells like fish. There you have it, garnished off with a wedge of a lemon just because fish that's grilled isn't complete without a squirt of it all. Love it. Then we're gonna open this up. It's gonna be amazing here on the beach. Thank you so much everyone for watching. We have our tofu fish belly and our tofu chon, care of the Real Veggie Guys, our ensaladang seaweed and even our veggie kebab. Complete meal, so colorful, so much vibration into it. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel, Veg on the Edge. Like, follow us on our other platforms on Facebook and Instagram as well. And enjoy the beach, guys. I send you good vibes from the tides. This is Cassie Umali. Remember, peace begins on your plate. This is tasty as it is. Look at that. My goodness. It tastes like the sea, but sea vegetables. Mmm. Perfect to eat this next to the ocean.